Rick Astley will be playing the Pyramid Stage at 12 o'clock and also doing a set of Smith's covers with Blossoms tonight at the Woodsies. Let's now speak to someone who's playing the kids' field, Basil Brush, and you have come as the headliner of the festival. Ah, uh, yes, I've decided to release my inner Elton. Uh, uh, so hold me close, a tiny dancer. Goodbye, yellow brick road. Uh, I would do candle in the wind, but not near the toilets. <laughs> Boom, boom. <laughs> in many ways, are you the Elton John of the kids' field, being a sort of, you know, more established heritage act? Ah, yes. Well, I've been five years now in the kids' field, and I'm top of the bill over there, and I'm looking forward to one day perhaps being top of the bill on the pyramid stage. And I thought, if Elton got a little bit of a sore throat like the Arctic monkeys, I'm there to step in, and from 20 yards back, you wouldn't notice the difference. I've got enough feathers, I think. <laughs> and finally, the question we ask a lot of people, where are you staying? caravan tent oh no a lot of my foxy friends make me a little set at the top of worthy farm uh, and if i've had an all-nighter in block nine wherever i lay my brush that's my tent uh. basil have a great time thank you for coming thank dressed you. as elton now let's go this way and speak to a band who are having a heck of a year the lottery winners from lee because you've been going 15 years but not only have you just had your first ever number one album, it is called Anxiety Replacement Therapy, but you are playing Glastonbury how many times? Six times we're playing. Too many, that, innit? Yeah. Too many times to be playing that. No one needs six. This is Tom and Kate, because uh, the thing you had not threw up through before you did this, if you're playing six times, that's a lot of times you can't be watching bands. It's very true, but obviously a great privilege, and we're so happy to be here. But yeah, six sets. We can't even watch Elton John, and I love Elton John. I wish he was my nan. Have you got a, cra a clash? Nasty clash? Yeah, we can't even see Elton, and I love him. But the first gig that you did... Basil is Yeah, Basil is yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll let you in and meet him in a minute, yeah. but listen, explain just how big the crowd was, because you've played already once. Yeah, it was supposed to be like a little intimate set at the Strummerville, but the whole of the festival went there. They had to, like, shut the gates, didn't they? It was like a thing. It was an actual look on the pictures. It was a thing. You were, you were happening, were you? We were kind of a big deal. Number one album now on telly and that, you know what I mean? Now, have you seen any celebrity spots yet at all? Because last night I was walking behind the Pyramid stage, and I'm sure I saw Remy Malik, who played Freddie Mercury, sitting on a seat that a security guard had given him going, I'm just an ordinary person. But I'm, I'm not, can't completely confirm it. Uh, well, we've seen Gok Wan in That's our uh, camping, but yeah, backstage at the, behind the pyramid, just everyone there is just a celeb. You're just like, wow, it's great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, we are celebrities now, yeah. so it's kind of just like our people, you know what I mean? Well, I know you do get starstruck. <laughs> you, so. you would like a picture with Basil, right? so we're going to let you, right? we're going to make your dreams come true here in BBC Breakfast. Right go on, Tom. Oh! Go, on, go and get a selfie. Go yes, and get a selfie. Jesus. There Here we you are. go. We're making yeah. dreams come true. Oh, thank Basil, you Kate, you on the phone? Come on. Go on, Kate. Go on, Kate. Get the snaps in. Get the photo. There we go. We'll leave you from Glastonbury with lottery winners. Meeting Basil Brush dressed as Elton John. Oh, yeah. That can kind of thing only happens here. Can you give us a fiver? Lottery winners. <laughs> Colin, thanks so much. And Basil, of course.